I'm with Dr. Larry Kawa, a very prominent orthodontist in Boca Raton, who has had a most interesting sojourn over the last few months of our electoral period here in the United States. And Larry, you and I have known each other for quite a number of years. About 15 years. About 15 years, practice planning, practice transition. We've been through so much, but never what you've been through the last few months. Now, share with me. You did what? It's been an interesting journey. Uh, last few years I've watched TV, watched the news, been engaged, but not really to the extent that I was really ready to, to take it to the next level. Uh, last December I started my own political action committee known as a PAC. Amazing. Uh, thank you. It's called American Courage. You could go on American-Courage.com to see it and learn more about it. All right. And my goal of starting the PAC was to get more and more doctors engaged and, of course, dentists, physicians, all healthcare providers engaged in a process that they have seen themselves historically as disenfranchised from. And what, what exactly did you do here locally? Well, I wound up recruiting some really great top name speakers that I never really thought I would have access to, like Eric Cantor, the majority leader of the United States House of Representatives, Tim Pawlenty, the former governor of Minnesota, uh, Alan West, who was a local congressman here in South Florida, uh, Adam Hasner, who was running for Congress, former majority leader of the Florida House, mm -hmm. uh, Rudy Giuliani, who I had at my own home for dinner literally about eight weeks ago and uh, had a lot of doctors Just come here. extraordinary. Crazy. Thank you. Rudy. There's even more, though. There's more. Uh, the list goes on and on. All but the way up to presidential candidates. All the way up to presidential candidates. My wife and I uh, hosted uh, Mitt Romney, Paul Ryan. Uh, we, we have uh, an, an impressive list that we're very proud of. But I will share with you that it's something that more and more doctors need to do because right. either we're going to defend ourselves or we're going to get swallowed up in the current. Well, that and, is and to see what you have done and to go from ground zero to having this ability to talk directly, share and interact with these individuals. And many of the folks that, that you had come to your events were local doctors. They were. Uh, our largest event that we hosted was the Tim Paul Enti event. We had 350 doctors come to that. Uh, after he gave his speech, uh, over 100 of them went to dinner with us and Tim Pawlenty. Tremendous. They loved it, and I wish more and more doctors would get engaged because it's time that we stand up for ourselves because nobody else is standing up for us. Well, Larry, I appreciate you sharing. Thank you, Thank Randy. you. Thank, Thank you. you.